Right, in the last video we've just very quickly looked at the scales, press the button on, reset, turn it back off again. I think this one's got a time delay so it turns itself off. But there is a strange feature which is very useful, a function you might want to call it, called the tear feature. So tear, it's a rather un unusual uh, word, but it comes from the Arabic and it's to do with the difference a difference. So that when we weighed the marble and then just recorded the total, what we looked at was, well take the marble out, its mass drops and that's how you work out what the marble weighed. But the scales have got a very special feature called a tear feature or function which can calculate the difference by subtracting the container's mass. So let's do that. So, zero on the scales at the moment. Let's say they've been switched on for a while. You should always leave them switched on for five minutes, 10 minutes, half an hour for, for more sort of complex scales. Let's put on the little container. Remember powders and liquids and stuff, you want to put them in a container. So four gram. So I'll put the marble in. No, why don't we just press the button again? Zero. So what it's done is recalculate that the whole scale pan and whatever you've just put on it has zero mass. So it's done the subtraction for you. Now, when you put the marble in, six gram. So the tear feature or difference, subtract the difference feature is very, very useful. Similarly with uh, liquid, look at that, minus four gram, because we had previously use the tear function in order to zero the balance and now we've taken it off it's showing minus a mass of four gram so let's just tear it again back to zero so there's the the ballot the um measuring cylinder again so it's very useful for being able to measure and subtract the difference such that you get the true mass of whatever you've put in the container. So 32 gram, tear it, zero gram. Now, it's not advisable usually to pour the water in or a liquid in when it's on the scales. Otherwise, you end up, um, you know, you could end up spilling it. So that's that, let's have a look. So I've just measured out seven millilitres there. Now we've got zero, is it zero? Uh, the zero has disappeared, hasn't it? Because we've taken the container off and it's saying minus 32. Pop it back on. And it says that's about eight, well, eight gram. Well, really, I don't think that's very accurate. Let's have a look again, minus 32, zero it. 38 gram. Pour it out. 32. Scrap that. 